In this video, I'm going to show you how to unlock a Facebook disabled account. I had my Facebook account locked or disabled a few weeks ago and I tried contacting Facebook support and I couldn't get anywhere. I decided to take the matters into my own hands. I tried everything and I managed to figure out a way to unlock the account without having to get Facebook support involved or for them to do something. I believe the process that was used to lock my account was all automated. There was no particular reason why my account was locked. And in order to unlock it, I basically went through a process of getting my password reset. So let me show you what I had to do. Now firstly, this is the message that I received when I was trying to log into Facebook. Your Facebook account has been suspended. This is because your account or activity on it doesn't follow our community standards. If you think we suspend your account by mistake, you, should, you have 90 days to disagree with our decision. If you miss this deadline, your account will be permanently disabled. Now I was a bit hesitant to have my account permanently disabled because I manage a couple of Facebook business pages and I didn't want to not have access anymore. I did try to follow the prompt that asks for the account to be reviewed as you can see this was the email that I received but after a few weeks I didn't hear back so then I decided what would I need to do to get my password unlocked and I accidentally stumbled across on a method to get it unlocked hopefully this method also works for you if it doesn't please don't dislike this video <laughs> Just take into consideration there are many ways for the account to be locked and this particular method worked for me. Hopefully it may work for you as well. So let me show you. What you've got to do is you've got to go to this URL https slash slash www.facebook.com slash login slash identify. Here you'll find this prompt. You need to enter your email address. I tried my mobile number and it didn't work. So just enter your email address that is associated to your Facebook account. And then do a search. Once you did a search, you'll be seeing your profile and then try to log into the account. Then there'll be an option to do a, a password reset. Once you do the password reset, you'll be able to log in again, but you receive this error message. Your account has been locked. We saw unusual activity on your account. This may mean that someone has used your account without your knowledge. Account locked. To protect you, your profile is not visible to people on Facebook and you can't use your account. Be able to follow these prompts. So click on get started and then follow through all the prompts. And then you'll be able to do a password recovery. And one of the reasons you may be able to choose is my, fa uh, my account got hacked. And that's the really, that's the choice that I selected as to the reason why I'm doing the I'm going through this process. So yeah, follow all the prompts, and then once you go through all the prompts, you basically receive this error message when you try log in again, saying if it looks like someone might have access to your Facebook account to secure a password, you need to answer a few questions and change your password the next time you go to Facebook. For your protection, no one can see you in Facebook until you secure your account. So make sure you do that as well. And once you reset your password, you'll be able to log in. So for a few days, you will not be able to post anything that has a picture. I was able to post messages. I was able to contact other people, but I was not able to post anything that had a picture or attached a picture to the post, especially on my Facebook pages. So what you've got to do is just recently uh, today, I am able to do that. So the system, the Facebook algorithm or system to, that checks, checks after seven days after you've done the, the password reset and password recovery, you'll be able to have the account fully active. But during that seven days, you're basically, your account is partially active. The other things you might want to do is you want to, once you've logged in, you might want to check to see whether there's anything unusual. So if you can go to like your settings and privacy and you check your activity log, 
you'll be able to see whether there was anything that was unusual. In my particular case, I did see something unusual. I saw something that was posted at about 5.18 a.m., which I'm normally asleep at that time. So something did happen, and I guess that's the reason why the account might have been locked. These are just my suspicion. I don't have a full record of it or, or, the, or the reason why Facebook didn't give me a reason. But I, that's what I suspect. Something must have happened and the account may have locked. You may want to also remove a couple of apps and websites that you no longer need your Facebook connected to. And that's about it. So these are the steps that I use to unlock my disabled Facebook account. Hopefully it may help you as well. If it does, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. That way I'm able to publish more videos and other people who are having the same problem will be able to watch this video and get into their Facebook account. Like always, I'll see you next time.